Welcome back to Best Buddy Gaming. Today we have the newly released Little Guardsman. This game, I, I think it's like a point and click adventure and it looks absolutely hilarious. I think this is more of a sort of a comedy-esque style game. So I'm, I'm pretty pumped about this. I think this is going to be a blast. Say, what is this? So do me a favor. Yeah, let's, uh, level, oh, that's cool. So go new game. Let's get cracking. So if you want to do like certain guys, like yeah. that. Yeah, all right. So it came to pass oh, here we go. Day was to be saved by the most unlikeliest of heroes. A small, small child, child. unwilling <laughs> thrust into Not dressed like anybody else. <laughs> yeah, I know, right? Disaster after another had Modern clothes. Due to her diligent and cunning decision -making. Yeah, so basically, I think you just end up making tons of awful decisions that mess everything up for oh, everybody. Really? Yeah. Prosperity. Our hero could finally rest their weary head, but only after one more critical there we go. decision was to be made. A decision. I think this is going to be like different gameplay, but like kind of how we had fun with Storyteller. Oh. Why? <laughs> well, that's not good. You've made the wrong choice. Told you. Oh, no. Think things through. You've doomed us all. Everything's on fire now. Covered in fire. How could you have done this to us? Oh my God. Is that a tree? Oh man, that's hilarious. It's like a massive tree. Lil. Lil? That's Lil. her name? Alright. Oh, there we go. What? That's true. I guess it's her oh, literal Dad, name. I was. Oh, I must have been having a nightmare. It's over now, sweetie. But since you're awake, I think it's time you and oh, I game had the talk. Oh. Out of one nightmare and into another. <laughs> sweetie, there comes a time in every young person's life. Dad, I like the uh, you don't have I like the graphics. This. Yeah. When they have to work their dad's shift at the guard shed while oh, he places no. a bet on the goblin ball match down at the pub. <laughs> Aw, Dad, do I have to? Oh, no. <laughs> Today was the day I was going to start off on a grand adventure with my friends. No, you I want to sail the open sea. I want to fight ogres. I, I want to throw rocks at things. You think I didn't want to throw rocks that at things? That guy's voice sounds wicked familiar. Age? But I had a duty. I had a responsibility. I guarded I the shop. Had to work at the guard shed while my dad placed <laughs> the bet at the goblin ball match down at the pub. <laughs> the did goblin he ball. Anything? Nope. Do you think we'd be stuck here if he did? Yeah, I was gonna say. But I'm twelve. Won't we get in trouble? Not if we don't get caught. Come on. I'll show you how to handle anything that comes up. Oh, this should be, this should be interesting. This is not gonna end well. I'm already gonna mess up. I like these kind of comedy point and click adventures. I think they're a ton of fun. Oh no. Alright, so one oh, of five no people. Key. Ready for me to very quickly show you how everything works? Yes. Yes, sir. Oh good. Everyone loves a tutorial. <laughs> Seriously. No time for a full rundown, so I'll sum it up like this. The key thing to remember when being a castle guardsman is Don't mess up. Dad, someone's coming. Oh. What are we no doing? tutorial for you. Uh okay. I guess the best way to learn is by doing. Let's just hope there's someone completely plain and boring. <laughs> oh, this, this should be it's interesting. Gonna be like a whole yeah, it's gonna be some weirdo. Oh, okay, okay. Ah, I thought it was gonna be good dragon. morning, Mrs. Abernathy. How's your day today? Does I this look like Gravity Falls anime? Plain and boring. <laughs> plain and boring. It does. Bingo. That looks like Mabel. Would you mind if Lil looks after you? Oh, not at all. It's always a pleasure to see your daughter, Shamish. No, she's gonna have some it's something English. ridiculous in that thing. Hey. <laughs> what is? <she>? Shamish. <laughs> Never mind. Now, Lil, when a visitor approaches the guard shed, they'll generally start by stating their business. I'd like to state my business. I bring a basket of baked goods to my son and his family once a week. Oh, would you like one? Nope. Don't take any from strangers. <laughs> I'm not eating that. I'm throwing it on. Oh, nice. Inventory, okay. Oh, After they they their oh yeah, I bet we trade stuff. I like throw it at things. Yep. You Get out of here, old lady. And interrogate them. There's tools, the phone there on the wall. You only oh, this get is cool. Action points. You get it, right? Yeah. Okay. Kinda. Not really. <laughs> what do we need <laughs> tools for? I know, right? Like... You can pick one and it does something. Come oh, on. It does no something. kidding. Obviously. I really got to speed this along. The Goblin Ball game is about to start. Oh, I'm sorry. I'm inconveniencing you? <laughs> oh, no, not at all, dear. I don't mind helping out. 
But the princess is whirly gigging the ceremonial first slingshot. Whirly gigging? <gasps> she is? Sweet jumping jitters, we gotta get to that game. Let's wrap this up, dear. Seamus, tell the girl what to do. <laughs> the name is Hamish. <laughs> it's Seamus. No, it's, it's Mrs. Abernet. <laughs> 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 All right, select any highlighted element. Okay, so what's highlighted? Ah, so yeah, let's you. learn about her. I told you, selecting the person means you interrogate oh, okay, them well, and hear more of their story. Can we do it? Gotcha. It's the best way to find out someone's true intentions. Okay, so that. Some, so, sometimes. Sometimes. <laughs> Click on the bag. That's our inventory, I'm assuming? Sometimes using a tool will do the job better. Or the phone, or it's a combination of things. Ah. I don't know. You can spend all three action points just interrogating them for all I care. <laughs> That's pretty cool. All right, so click on the, uh, yeah, click on that. The Royal Writ. If the Castle God Corp can achieve a good star rating this month. Okay, so these are just little, little things. Congratulations to Randy on 35 years. Uh, first thing you know when you start is your shift is to take a look. Okay, cool. So click that. It's got a lot of information. Yeah, so this is basically kind of just data points that you need. Yeah. Anytime and it won't cost you any action points. All right, that's cool. All right, so that's, that's helpful. Uh, okay, you missed that. There you go. All right, so click the. Uh, what's, what's that behind that? Yeah, what is that? Is that the inventory? Oh. Our tools. Ah. If you want to use a tool, you have to make sure it has a crystal to charge it. Here, oh. I'll show you. I'll add today's crystals to the tools that don't have any. That way, I have a well-rounded arsenal. This is pretty cool. Why did the other tools the sword. already have crystals in them? Is that a sword? I carried them over from previous days. Any other questions? Ah, Why does a interesting. Bull whip need to be powered by crystals. <laughs> no more questions. Yeah, don't ask. Don't ask silly questions. All right, so that's. Oh. Uh, ah, uh, some perfume. They might have stuff like in their jacket. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, cool. So that's that's interesting. Uh, click the phone. I'm worried. Feeling stuck? This phone is for calling the royal advisors and asking for their ah. help. Ah. What they give you is their opinion. Okay, so that, I mean, I guess it could you be helpful. Get a hold of Lieutenant Stryker, Captain okay. of the Guards, and technically our boss. Hello, who's there? Oh. Oh, oh no. Oh, she hung up. That's not or nice. First Councilwoman Ash, the head bureaucrat of the Sprawl, with a real mind for politics. Okay. This is Councilwoman Ash. Hello. Hello, is somebody there? Prank call. <laughs> And finally, the royal jester Malcolm, oh, no. chaos oh, personified funny. in human form. Hello, you oh. reached Malcolm. Please leave a message after the goose honk. <laughs> hey, where'd the goose go? Well, chase after it, for goodness sake. <laughs> each call costs an action point. Oh, boy. Okay. Now, click the... Uh... Yeah, so we got to click on each one of these things, so... So I'm guessing... All right, so that's our inventory. inventory. That's your inventory bag where you keep the yep. things... Yeah, okay, we get that, so you can click that. that. you confiscate from them. Looking in your bag for something to use doesn't cost you okay. anything. I would hope not. Yeah. Okay. And then this no. doohickey. You use the Wicked 3000 to make the big decision to let someone in. Ah, send them packing. Send them packing. Okay. I don't want to send you packing. Yes. Now you can um, choose to use the I would let her in. 3000 at any point during a turn. But sometimes it's better to use up all three action points to find out everything you can by any uh, means necessary. That makes sense. Sometimes? Yeah. And sometimes people are in a really big hurry, like I am right now. So just pick a damn lever all day. <laughs> uh, pick the green one on the left. That looks like a good one. Uh, no, I'm kidding. Yeah. Okay. There you go. All right, that's pretty cool. Great job, Lil. Your mother would be so proud to see you now. After my delivery, I'm off to watch the big game. I wonder if she's got something bad in there. Yeah. Got my grandson's inheritance riding on a tip that the Stapleford Snughorns are gonna win it today. Here's a tip. Never lend Mrs. Abernathy money to bet with. <laughs> yeah, no kidding. Don't Let's blow through your life savings. To the game. We don't want to be late, do we, Hamish? Hey, she got the name right. My name is Shamish. No, oh. wait, it's not all. <laughs> oh, I better go. Time to put on your big kid pants. You can do this. All right, we got this. <laughs> More like I'm being forced to do this. It's only for today, I swear. Come meet me in the tavern when the shift is over. Good luck. So uh, that's one out of... Good luck with I know. Legal gambling. <laughs> I don't need luck. All right, so we got one out of five people he done. He does. <laughs> yeah, this really does look like Gravity Falls, doesn't it? Okay, yeah. well, you got this. Okay. 
I'm not even prepared. So, Miss Abernathy, you nailed that tutorial. Yeah, okay, thank you. I'm not prepared at all. I know, it should be fun. I don't even know what I'm doing. Okay, if the castle yeah, guard can achieve a good... I just want to make sure I didn't miss anything. Six month undercover operating yeah. at the Sprawl Tavern. A group of sweet Grammys and Grampies were discovered to be traffic. Oh, that's not good. She's bringing bad things in there. Oh, we should have denied her. Oh, that's not good. Oh, no. Well, it's the old lady. Is that a vampire? Whoa. To make your acquaintance, young Gateminder. I am Tyronius Athanatos, son of Brielle and Darunia Athanatos. What? I have been summoned to deliver the keynote speech at the Festival of Magical Freedom tonight, hosted by the Mages Guild. Okay. Will you require anything further? Uh, yes. So, click, uh, click on him? What's your speech about? Oh, my dear child. It is obvious to me that you do not possess a magical bone in your body. Oh, don't be and so negative. therefore, would only serve to confuse and frighten you. Uh, I doubt. Tease. Uh, yeah, I do doubt. I doubt that. I think I can figure <laughs> it out. And many non-magical beings have attempted to learn the arts, and many of those have gone mad trying to even comprehend them. Be warned. Interesting. Okay, so what is that? Oh, so that's our action point. Okay. Um, let's do... I would, uh... I No, you don't want to give him anything. I, I would let him in. Let him in. Right? He seems like I don't think he's Wait, bad. We jail guys oh, that's interesting. Okay. Get out of here. The House of Thanatos and indeed the entire Mages Guild, thank you, young guardian. You will go far. I figure if we can have him on our good side. Oh, I can't believe that old lady, we should not have let her in. You let a powerful mage into the sprawl, but you fail to follow the writ. The devil is in the details. Oh, what? Darn it. Okay, so go back to the writ. We should not... Okay, I gotta read that thing better. What did we miss? Did it say something about mages? Is it different things? Oh, what the geez. heck? Good afternoon. <laughs> I am here to pick up my two kids from the no-good, stingy, low-life of a father who happens to be my lying, cheating, <laughs> low-life of an ex-husband, Orlando. <laughs> Orlando, the one-eyed monster. His address is there on this incomprehensible, illegible letter my kids sent me. What? Uh, <laughs> Believe me, I would love to have him get off his sorry butt and bring them to me for once. Okay, so go to the red again. So what the heck did we miss there? The castle guard could achieve, okay. From the desk of the castle woman. Demonstration decision held by the members of the mage. If any of the speakers come through your gate, please call my office to initiate. Oh my God, all we gotta do is call the thing. We messed that up. Darn it. And no grandmas. Okay, so hold on a sec. So depressed joker seeks person with a funny name. If you call and pique my interest, there's a cash bonus in for you, Malcolm. So That's that we gotta remember. Funny name. Yeah. But we don't know her okay, name. Okay, so I think this, no, but th there's a joker that should be coming. So I think this lady we can let through. There's nothing bad on here, right? Yeah. Okay, I think, yeah, this is okay. So, we'll yeah, click on her real quick. It was his week with them. No, I'm sorry. It was his and his new girlfriend, <laughs> Callie's week with them. <laughs> oh, she is and not happy. do you happy. know what the kids say about her? They say she's fun. Oh, jeez. Okay. I'm sure the letter they wrote is all about her. Can't decode it to save my life, though. My kid's writing is so lousy. <laughs> uh, do it to a tease. I don't understand. Do you stop being fun when you reach a certain age? <laughs> <laughs> no, you just get more tired. Oh, I feel bad for this lady. Let her in. No, let her in. Oh, uh, okay. Yeah, go ahead. Go get your, your kids. And Failed. I know. Watch. Oh, I can't believe though. Oh, it really drives me nuts with the old lady and the mage. I can't believe we messed that up. Well, that old lady was just too. Thanks. Yeah, but we could have denied her. Polyphemus, Orlando Junior. Mama's coming for you. Polyphemus. Good luck. Okay, Wait. let's see. Do we get a jester coming? I want to get a jester. We got to call Malcolm. You knew not to stand in the way of a mama yeah. bear and a cubs. Oh, so we got a three star for the old lady. Yeah, because it was just. The oh, star. so okay, so we're okay then. So that didn't count against that. Okay, okay. So just the mage, we... Oh, what? Old guy. What in the bloody blazing blasted hell is the holdup? Why have we stopped, Welp? Oh, I don't like this guy. That's an well, old guy. Sir, the guard. <laughs> Silence! 
Speak when spoken to, or you'll get the whip. Whip. <laughs> whip. Yes, whip. sir. So this is an old guy, though. I wonder if they smuggle now, in the bad stuff. Child, let Should me we whip pass. him? I have no, don't whip him. He wants, he's getting to him the whip. Come on, uh, so hold on. Oh, open the writ again. Waits for no man. His name is BS. BS? <laughs> Bank of the Sprawl. Ah, Sprawl, don't let him in. Well, that's Don't let him in. No. Deny. Get out of here. Yeah, see you later, guy. Go home. Three star, three star. Didn't even have to interrogate him. Oh. Go home. It's the goblin's fault, isn't it? Will have an effect on the sprawl. Oh, interesting. Oh, I like how this is kind of like a sort of build your own adventure. The gate, but I shall leave the goblin tied up outside like the cur he is. Uh. Sir, the gold. Yeah, see, it's not gold. Silence. All right, you rotten little girl, I'll go. But you oh. rue the day you crossed me. Yeah. See you later, BS. <laughs> All right. So, wait a minute. Oh, so we had to investigate it, though? Well, uh, we did it right, though. But that's interesting. So even if you make the right choice, there's still things you want to check. Oh, All right. Hello. Pick up the phone. Good ahoy, ahoy. This is Dr. Marquess, Beatrix von Matterhorn calling. What? Who may I ask? Am I speaking to? This Shame is Will. Nice to meet you, Will. I need one of you gate guards to come down to the dig site as soon as you can. Hang up. Okay, and where exactly is... Oh, that's not good. She hung up. Maybe we can ask somebody who comes by. She gonna walk away? Just this is cool. I, I really like this. Oh, look at oh, this guy. No. What? Why, hello there. Hey. <laughs> Sprawl to participate in capitalism. The sprawl is the place we are in. I know, but the bank of the sprawl, those... Oh, you're right. Darn it, I think we... <laughs> Oh no. After years on the road but he said old people. Merchant, I'm finally ready to put down roots. And what better place than the sprawling metropolis? This is the, the last guy for the shift. Huh. <laughs> I just got that. Garby Bunches is the name. Garby Bunches. <laughs> Garby Bunches? <laughs> funny, funny name. name. But that's got to be me. Funny up. name. Okay, what I'm do you mean funny name? What do you laughing for? You're going to call him Jester. Oh, okay. Yeah, call Malcolm. Can't fault you for doing your due diligence. Here's my vendor's license issued by the Sprawl Board of Trade. Okay. Uh, re no, 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 uh, return it. He's right. Everything is in order. Okay. Can't That's, even read it. <laughs> I know. So now call Malcolm. Malcolm. We got a Mr. Here. Tight Pants here. Where have I heard that name before? Wait a minute. Ask him if he's descended from Garbanzo the Terrible. <laughs> All right, so. related to Garbanzo the Terrible? Okay, never mind. I thought we had to interrogate him. Yep. My great 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 grandpappy Garbanzo. OMG, tell him I'm a huge fan. <laughs> I've got so many questions. Like, why did he use an ice cream scoop? How did he dispose of all that mess? This isn't helpful. <laughs> You're not helpful. <laughs> all right, so interrogate that guy. I just can't wait to get in the mix and figure out what kind of merchant this place really needs. Since I was a boy selling lemonade, when life literally gave me lemons, I've dreamed of maximizing profits and keeping overhead low. Okay. Uh, I trust him. I trust him. I've always said this place needs a nondescript vendor to shake things up a little. See, you get it. Once I've set up shops selling, well, whatever I decide to sell, I'll be sure to give you a discount. Okay. I look forward to buying... Uh, something. something. <laughs> Alright, so let's see... Um... I, I, I would let him in. Wait, what is he selling though? We don't know yet. He's going to look and see what he wants to sell. Admit him. X-ray. X-ray? Okay, He's yeah. Oh. It in. oh, okay. So, ec good call, buddy. Good call. And then X-ray that. I want to see what he's selling. Get towards the... Uh-oh. No, we should have seen what he's was in the clear. bag. It's showing the whole thing. Oh, we should have x-rayed the, the Guys, goblins thing. Surprisingly, this guy doesn't have anything interesting on him. <laughs> Wait, he's trying to sell something. I sent all my belongings ahead of me with everything I'll need to set up shop. Wait, was it the goblin? I don't really care about that. <laughs> all right, I think we'll... I don't really care whether or not you really care. <laughs> all right, send him in. Yeah, he can go. Yeah, he seems harmless. This was cool. All right, what do we get? Can we Can do it right. You smell that? Uh oh. The trash barge? 
Yeah, it comes through on the weekends. The smell only lingers for a couple of days. It's the smell Not of the sweet success. Of decay. That's the reek of opportunity. <laughs> See you around. <laughs> Well, oh, I think this game's just gonna be more fun. Yes! Funny name would lead to connecting Jester Malcolm to one of his historical heroes. Ah, oh, cool! Alright, so if this shift is over, we'll probably... Oh! Bells ring in the distance. No more, folks! Time to close up shop. Nice. Level 1 score. Ah, oh, cool! Hey! Nice! Duty of Drop Performance 3, you were paid 20 gold for this shift. Nice. Shift's complete. Miss Abernathy, you nailed that. Okay. Go next. Ah, man, I'm really mad we missed that one. Again, that was my fault. Go one more. And, th yeah, this lady, we were good. And then the old guy, yeah, we should have scanned his stuff. And then Garby Bunches. All right, cool, continue. That guy was nice. Yeah. I like that guy. Dude, this was very cool. So I think we're going to meet up with the dad real quick, yeah. right? I don't know what they... Let's see what happens here. Oh, we're going to different places? I guess so. I don't know. So we're going. Oh, so you can click. The oh, the dig site. Okay, so hold on a second. Oh, this oh. is... Yeah, Oops. okay, so the dig site. No, that's right. That makes sense. Yeah, because she wanted she, to... She told us to go there, so I guess like after the shift, you go down. Oh, crystal. This is cool. Oh, to refill. Gotcha. All right, so click that. Am ammonia, hydrogen, iodine, all pretty basic stuff. Okay, so click on the lady, maybe? Uh, okay. Oh, so we can buy stuff. One of Miss Abernathy's famous buds. Yeah, yeah, okay. So click on, uh, click on the lady? Oh, there we go. Ah, okay, so talk with her. Oh my, were you left behind? The last group of school children departed hours ago. Feel free to wait in the lost and found <laughs> box until someone comes to collect you. <laughs> no, you called me. I'm Lil. We spoke on the phone. I was covering for my dad at the South Gate. There you go. Ah, uh, of course, Lil. Yes. Yes, yes, yes. <laughs> but no, this is highly irregular. But then again, you'll have to do for the sake of time. Okay. <laughs> sake of time. <laughs> do you get it? I don't get it. No. <laughs> the clock. Trust me, you will. Who are you? Who are you again? Dr. Marquess Beatrix von Matterhorn, head of archaeological research at the Royal Academy. But you can call me B. Okay, B. Please. Got gotcha. it. Okay. And what's so great about this place? Oh, there we go. So she asked it anyway. Would you like the long or short version? Uh, short and sweet. It's a hole in the ground where we get power crystals from. Ah, okay. Thank that you. was short. Sweet. <laughs> okay, uh, let's see. What's this got to do with me? I am the preeminent expert in the advanced properties of power crystals, and my research suggests we have barely scratched the surface of what these puppies can do. This is pretty, okay. uh, but again, pretty in-depth already. I like it. Do with me? Nothing. You're well, just in the right I place at the wrong time. How to harness the crystal's power to alter the very fabric of time. May I present the Chronometer 3000? Nice. And what I need to know from you is... That's cool. Do you know anyone who would be willing to go on what some might call an adventure? Yes, ma'am. Yes, me. Uh, do, do yes, me. Oh, push oh, the button. Oh, oh. Do push the button. This should be funny. Oh. She probably shouldn't have done that. No, oh, no. Oh, no. <laughs> oh, no. We just destroyed the fabric of time. Uh oh. Oh, boy. And the game is over. Uh-oh. Oh, no. Wait, what? Where am I? What just happened? I bet you went back in time. Oh, no. Grab that phone. Pick up the phone. Freak out. <laughs> Good afternoon. Ahoy, hoy. This is Dr. Marquess, oh. Beatrix von Matterhorn calling. Who may I ask? Oh. You? This is Lil. Deja vu. Deja vu. Yeah, do deja vu. Check this out. You were about to tell me you need a gate guard to come down to the dig site, right? My word, you gate guards are intuitive. <laughs> I hope they're paying you a more than fair wage. They probably aren't, the way my dad complains about it. Oh, okay, that's not good. She hung up. Big surprise. Again. Dude, that was 
pretty cool. I wonder what... Deja vu. We definitely did something. Why, hello there. I've come to the sprout oh my goodness. participate in capitalism. Oh After years on the road... I so click on that guy. Let me stop you there. Your name is Grabby Blanchers, right? You're a traveling merchant or yeah. something? Oh, I see my reputation precedes me. Kind of. The name is Garby Bunches. Garby Bunches. This is so weird. I swear I already dealt with this guy. I can either do the same thing as I did last time, or, or maybe this is a chance to try something different. Oh, this is interesting. I'm sorry. Are you talking to me? <laughs> That's what I'm trying to decide, Garbs. Okay, so... Regardless, here's my vendor license. Vendor license. Sprawl so do this. So click on that. This time, confiscate it. Nice. Oh, um, I think I might need that. No, I think I'm going to need it more. <laughs> okay, if you say so. So we probably just messed this guy, guy up. And get my butt back to the dig site. Okay, so send this guy through. And then get back to the dig site, and then we'll stop it there. We'll see what happens first. That was hilarious. This is cool, man. I, I really, I enjoy I this. We are. I've done this already. I remember pulling the lever. Yep. Can you smell that? Oh God. I think then you said something about opportunity. You got it. See you around. This guy's funny. I like how tight his pants are. His belt. Okay, so then the I shift is over again. The dig site to figure out what just happened. Yeah, we just messed up the time continuum. All right, the shift is over. So then you come back out to the map. Huh. I think, unless they're going to bring us right there. Okay, so let's stop here. And next time we come back, we'll go back to the dig site and see what happens. And uh yeah, it is a tree, yeah. All right, cool. So if you guys like this video, like, comment, subscribe. Let us know if you want to see some more Little Guardsmen. This game looks like a ton of fun. It's very funny. And uh, these point-and-click adventures are always a good time. Yeah. So we'll see you guys soon. See you next time. Bye.